Hello, today is uh, two Wednesday, August 21st, I think. I'm trying to make this before my battery dies. Um, this is a video on altered papers from magazines and different types of circulars. Um, I was watching a video on Citrusol, and I found another video. The lady's name is Shemi Dixon, and she altered art pages using National Geographic but without Citrusol. So this is the item that she used. It's called Awesome. LA's Totally Awesome in a dollar store. So I n know that I did not have any um, National Geographic but uh, magazines but I just wanted to try some other papers while I was waiting for my magazines to come in. So I purchased this and this uh, very quickly this is a magazine from a Tonner's um, doll pamphlet or small doll magazine and this paper you can see the top half isn't done the bottom half is done was done only with the LA's totally awesome um, it takes a longer time and I sprayed it on and I used a brush and Basically, it's just taking off the coats of the um, print. It does not work like Citrusol. I mean, I do not have National Geographic, so I cannot say. But on magazines, it doesn't work that way. But if you want to alter the page, I guess you can. I know nothing about altering pages. I will tell you that. This was just an experiment for me. So, you know, I'm sure I'm saying things that you know people already know or disagree with but I was just experimenting with this particular um, solution um, you can watch the the, the ladies um, video where you can see where she actually does use this LA's totally awesome on National Geographic pages and she she does alter them um, going on to this one what's on the back of this one uh, that's how it looks on the back. Yeah, this the, totally came off, like just rubbed off. It also depends on what color you're, you are trying to alter. This was a very light silver, so it was easy to um, alter this page. So I was doing research trying to find out the ingredients in Citrusol and um, the concentrated orange. I thought I had sweet orange oil, but I didn't. I had lemon essential oil. So I put about 20 drops of that into this. And when I did, the um, altering accelerated. It really did accelerate. Um, this was a lady. I don't know. Here is her foot. She's wearing some long beads. But, um, yeah, this page, I don't know what happened to it. But I don't even particularly like this too much. But I guess, I don't know, you could find a use for it. On the other side, I didn't spray the other side, but you can see the difference, and I didn't manipulate this in any way. Okay, here's another one where it's red. Red, I find, is the color that leaches off first. Red readily leaches off of any page, any type of magazine, circular. The red will leach off with this type of solution. So this was a dress, um, and you can see how it has just leached off. You still see the red turned into a green. Um, it did work, I guess. And on the other side, which I did not really try to manipulate, that's what happened on that side. Okay. And very quickly, I like this one, which has given me an idea. This was from a book that I got, I don't know, thrift store, dollar store, whatever. And it's a thick, thick kind of glossy, you can see the gloss page. And, sorry. And the bottom is done with the awesome plus the lemon oil. The top is not manipulated at all. But imagine if you took the whole page and you cut it in different sections. Let's say you wanted to do this water um, altered. 
and you alter, alter different parts of the picture and then you put the picture back together again is that not an idea I think that that would be really really cool um, but this is how this turned out everything has a tinge of pink in it and green okay moving on very quickly very quickly very quickly this was a different magazine thinner pages inside we have like a two page spread it's family a little camping trip but this page here is the same page so this green was here this red was here okay as I get closer I don't think the camera is going to focus you will see little specks um, and it really is a nice effect um, to tell you the truth I don't really remember how I did this this was like one of the last ones and I think I left it in this pan okay now you see this pan has a design in the bottom and I forgot about the paper and I left the paper in the pan and I came back later today and I removed the paper and lo and behold this paper picked up the design in the pan you see the, the square the diamond and I don't know what I did but it did work and you can kind of see the bubbles and the little effects there so that's pretty neat if I could replicate that again that would be really great but I don't know and this was another toner I did take a picture before picture it was a girl wearing a very pale pink gown and she's totally gone so I don't really know how good that is and this was a lady wearing a black dress which is a dark color and I wanted to see if I could really get the dark color off but really just ended up kind of scratching it off and last but not least I, I can't show the whole picture on this one but um, this is a picture it was three people but I'm not going to show the top and they had very colorful clothes on and what I did was just work around the faces and the baby and you were able to leach out all of that color the lady was wearing a red blouse but you can see you can leach that out and then I guess you could work with the picture but um, I'm not working with these pictures because these are someone else's pictures and they are still recognizable as someone else's pictures so I would not work with these pictures I just want to make that clear I was just just experimenting to see um, what this solution did LA is totally awesome on different types of circulars and magazines to see if um, it would work um, I know you have to work on National Geographic only to get that type of um, smearing effects I'm, I'm waiting for those to come in but I guess if you know if you wanted to do another effect I guess this could work so um, this is just a quick video on altered art pages or altered pages that you can use in a collage that's basically what I was experimenting with them to see if I could see something nice that I could probably put in a collage but that's it for now cute little baby all right until next time bye